Okay, in this lesson, I want to explain an important thing called particle distance. For example, if you go to the select the polygon and draw something like this, and as you can see, uh, we have a pattern here. If you select a pattern in its properties, here we have an I will be explained them one by one, but first is particle distance in millimeters, the number. Uh, for better seeing that, you have to go in here and turn on mesh because this pattern in a 3D software always uh, created by meshes. As you can see, it's in triangles. This is one mesh and triangles. This number here, <clears throat> imagine, is the number from this point to the this point. A smaller number so this is this distance. The smaller number, as you can see, occur a large number of segments, a large number of the mesh. We have more mesh. And imagine if you want to simulate bending this pattern in a 3D, we have better quality for simulation. But if you increase the number of the mesh, we have we need more resources to simulation. Be careful about that. So a higher number, we have a smaller number of the mesh. And in this situation that it is just a pattern that uh, has a big facet edges, hard edges, it's not a problem. The problem occur, you bring it to the default number 20 the problem occur when you bend something for example we smooth curve click and drag smoothing <clears throat> and if you go to texture surface as you can see the problem occur here because we have a smaller number of the uh, triangles in this case you can see we have a facet edges here not smooth because we have smaller number of the mesh there we have other tools that you can create uh, uh, have create mesh here just in these edges not all but I explain it but if you select your pattern here you can give a smaller number of the particle distance i don't know why naming like this but it's there smaller number give you better quality as you can see smaller number means this distance is smaller and we have a better and better meshing here nice and smooth or you can bring it or for example a higher number lower number of mesh but you can see it when you're going to the texture. And as you can see, we have a bad mesh here. This line does not simulate. Simulate, just see this. Be careful about that. If you have a higher number here, we have very nice and fast simulation, but very bad quality. Be careful about that. A novel number, as you can see, we have better. And default number is nice. It's most cases so the most important thing is particle distance hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release